Uh, Brad, let's take a look at the markets. Everyone wants to know, are we headed for lower lows? We also have a Fed meeting next week. Don't know if that might move things at all. Well, yeah, I mean, we've, we've had this big uh, kind of lurch in the markets all of a sudden. And I mean, if you asked me a couple of days ago, you know, the Fed has their meeting next week um, and they're already in an announced kind of a plan for tightening monetary policy. Uh, they're winding down their asset purchases. They're going to finish that by March. The expectation is that they would uh, do a, a rate increase after that, and maybe we'll have four rate increases, maybe even five this year, uh, which is way more than people were expecting just a few months ago. Um, but, uh, you know, what's interesting is people say, I'm just reading in a Coinbase institutional research report, you know, the Fed is, you know, in some ways they say they're independent and they focus on the economics, but they also talk about financial stability. And if the markets are falling out, they're not going to go more aggressive than people are thinking. In fact, they maybe will go softer, you know. Um, but a few days ago, I might have said you might have seen a surprise rate increase next week. But I doubt it now with markets kind of, you know, not reacting very well to this. You know, it's, a, it's like the taper tantrum of 2013.